person, how do we know you are Christian? You people, <inaudible> you people here, you can't sleep without studying the word of God. <inaudible> do you know that a Christian is not supposed to pray to sleep? A Christian can't pray to sleep. The sleep must find you praying. I don't know if you're hearing me. Amen. When you feel in your heart you are finished praying, and you are speaking scriptures, when you, are, you enter your blessing, you do like this. Carry on speaking those scriptures. Praying. That's where the visions are born. Visions will never come to the people who cease to pray. He who ceases to pray has stopped tapel. to meditate. But if you Christians, you want to succeed in life, after you study the word of God, write to your nose, believe in God, God I wish somebody can just even speak that verse. Speak speak one one God. God. The Bible says it. The Bible says it. You you say, thank you, Father. Thank you, Lord. Even when you enter the blankets, the sleep will find you doing that. Even now, is there now you dream things of God? The reason why you are dreaming somebody actually sleep. And when you dream, you dream actually sleep. And you are running so much, and this person is following you. And you are still there. Ah, you are no just bad. screaming and shouting. Ah, and then. By the time Arwa Urema, by the time he wants was to eat you, you just woke up. This shows that sometimes you are off. A Christian must be a person who reads the Bible. Who read 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 I, I'm just trying to say that I know why I dream a lot. I just, like today, I just wake up and go straight to my mama. I dream. I dream one, two, three, one. Mama say, I know, I know this must this, this, we don't need this person again. I say, but, but I dream this person coming back here. Because this person has sinned against God. Karo, we, say, ah, no. No, we don't need this person again. I say, no, it's not that we need by our dream. I'm sure I understand what I'm trying to say. Amen. So some things that God will give you in your visions and dreams. How far you are dedicated in the world. Sometimes you need to be alone. I don't know if you're hearing me. After you read the scripture, you go and stand outside in the house. And you're alone and you're thinking, oh, thank you, Lord. Where there's nobody, where there's whiteness. You don't need a group. How to keep group. And you are meditating the scriptures that they give joy when peace is sustained in your heart. That, that's where you link up with God. I believe today God will give you a revelation of his word. And he will give you a hearing heart. Amen.